Do you have a website that's not producing traffic? Oh my goodness. Well, whose fault is it? It's important to understand this if you want to compete online. Building a website is no different than building a business, a building of any sort. Let's use Rugs as Art as an example, a beautiful location located on 41 in Sarasota. Let's just say you wanted to save the money on the real estate, then you built one in Mayaka City. That's a city, right? So you build a beautiful store there, you build one on 41. Six months, a year goes by, and you wonder, where's the traffic? Why is he doing so much more traffic than I am? Well, so many people build websites. They see these website builder programs, $29.95, you can build a website. Well, you can buy a, a, a nails and hammer and, and a saw at, at Sears or Home Depot too. Does that mean you can build a building? So when you build a building, like everyone will tell you in real estate, location, 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 well, let me tell you the key word that you need to know in the internet world, and that's going to be optimization, optimization, optimization. And that's followed by content, content, content. Because when you have the content, you're going to be able to optimize your website. If you build it properly, they will not come until you make an effort to be found. You have to be listed in directories. You have to have inbound links. You have to make an effort. That's like turning the lights on, saying, hey, we're here. Now, if you really want to accelerate the traffic, when you're in Mayaka City, you're limited to the cars that are driving by. On the internet, you're not limited to anything. You're wide open. You can do as much business as you want if you A, optimize your website with the content, and B, create a strategy and pay for it. Pay per click on Google is an extremely profitable effort. Don't be fooled by anyone who's failed that tells you, oh, what a waste. If they tell you how much they spent and can't follow it up with what they received for that, then it's not a good conversation for you to be holding on to. If they spent X amount, they should have received X amount. You can see all that. So don't be fooled and don't think that your questions are stupid. Ask your web developer, say, why aren't I getting the business I expected? Or even better, if you're building a website, ask what the expectation should be. Understand that when you pay for hosting, it's like paying rent. But when you start marketing and you start building it for results, now you're paying for results and you have every right to expect them. Don't think they're going to happen magically. Call me anytime to discuss this. Remember, when you build a website, pictures are nice, but every feature that you offer in your business, every service that you provide should be identified and written about. Because Google doesn't know that you carry that service or provide that service. If you don't make the sections with links in them, no one will ever know that you exist and that you provide that service. I'm available anytime. My name is Art Conforti of Bloomerang, 941 5445